Right, you ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, how are you? I'm Harry. And I'm Abby. And this is our first video, and we are coming from Mumbai, India. It is crazy. First impressions. This is our first time here, first time in India. Um, so we've already taken a short walk around the block and had some lunch. It's currently, uh, what is the time? 10 past six in the evening. Um, and we're about to head out and go and find a sort of a convenience store um, just to grab some water and a couple of snacks to the room. And then we're gonna do room service tonight. We're still a little bit tired from our flight. Um, but saying that, what's your first impression on Mumbai? Scary. Scary. Real scary. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's, it's, it's intense. It's fun, it's intense. If you like to be, um, if you like interacting, socializing, then- Taking photos of people. Taking photos, yeah, taking photos of people. We were asked several times um, when we went, we just went to have a look at the um, Gateway of India really quick. And we were asked for many, many photos. <laughs> and then uh, asked to go on about 15 different tours. But, um, hey, I guess that's all it was all about. Um, anyway, we're gonna go out, we're gonna show you the streets, real life Mumbai, expect from this channel, yeah. expect from these videos, real life, no fake rubbish, we're gonna show you what it really is like, truly, um, from behind the camera, and um, yeah, enjoy, this is gonna be a good one. Okay, now we're just leaving the hotel room. Um, now what's funny is, when you come and get in the lift, and I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you what happens in the lift. Somebody sat in the lift waiting for you. Um, maybe they just sit there all day, I'm not too sure. But, my God, it's hot. I'm just standing outside the hotel room, it's so hot. Um, there is a man in the... Yes, sir. Please, sir. Hello. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Ground floor, sir? Yes, please. Ground floor, please. Okay. How are you? You okay? Very good. Good. You are your friend, sir? Good. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Hello, little cat. We're, uh, so this here. Trying to find the shop. So and I think here. it thinks this is it. Um, all we're really looking for is a few bottles of water. Um, wow, look at this bus, guys. All the gang hanging off the back. I think the there. We'll find it, we'll find it. We're going to cross back over. No. Well, let's cross back over. Oh, we're, we're, I don't even know where we are, we're just walking. Just give me two minutes, just take a look at I don't shirt. need a suit though, bro. It's what okay. about a lovely shirt bag? It's okay, I've got too no. much. I've got too much already no, in my no, bag. No problem, no problem. This is my good. Thank you. No, I appreciate you. Thank you, you so much. Give me much. two minutes, just browse into my store, bro. I have best I've got now. too much already, though. I've got shirts. I have nice little, I can make a lovely little man, and I can make it in three hours. <laughs> it's okay. Thank, Thank you, though. No, no Thank problem. you. Sorry for trouble. No, no, not enjoy, at all. Enjoy your life. Not at all. Thank you, and you. What a nice guy. He's asked us three times to come into his into his shoe shop now, but uh, he's always been very polite about it when we say no. Um, but now just coming to the end of the street down to the main road. This is where we had lunch earlier, actually. Um, we're gonna head down the into the market. I think this is back towards our hotel. I'm pretty sure this is towards our hotel. Um, we'll definitely take a little bit later, but uh, yeah, this is super cool. Ooh, yeah. Gotta be super careful because there's a lot of ladies and burkers and stuff so she's trying to stay respectable hello trying to stay respectable to them as well and not show them on the camera um i don't know if you guys can even hear me hopefully again there's a lot of beeping 
a loud, joyful city. Um, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good. So not going on. Okay, so we are heading back to the hotel. We are in Hotel Suba Palace. Um, actually, it's a fantastic hotel. If you're ever in Mumbai and you want a great location, two minute walk from the Gateway of India, it's a fantastic hotel. There's a doggy and a cat, all living hand in hand in India. Could never be, could never be our dogs at home. <laughs> um, I tell you what, I don't know how people get the confidence to get a camera up and just speak to it while walking around. There's people staring at us as it is. And then with the camera, it's just crazy. Another doggy. Yeah. Hello doggy. Okay. Another cat, another cat. So we're gonna show you our hotel and our room. Actually, we were really lucky to get an upgrade. Um, is it this one? Yeah. It is. So we're just, we're just, hello, hello. So we're just, uh, we are, where are we? Down here on the right. So, there's a car behind me. There are always cars behind you. Another the car. Living at us, as they do. Oh, we're gonna show you the room, uncut. It's a bit of a mess, so bear with. But, uh, well, you're gonna walk in with us as we walk in. So, we were lucky enough that we actually got upgraded, bless them. We, upgrade, we were upgraded to the, I'll show you the royal suite um pretty posh but uh not like us anyway huge room um a nice dining area i'm actually gonna do some work there from my laptop um kitchenette very nice a sofa lounge area a single bed a double bed tv and the best part about it is a huge foot massager you can get your whole legs in there and it massage your legs and your feet which is an absolute treat. Um, right, we're gonna switch off, um, look at ordering some room service to the room. I think we just cooked from the flight, tired, um, overwhelmed. overwhelmed a little bit. It's one of them where you don't know what to expect, but you do know it's gonna be crazy. And it definitely lives up to that expectation. Um, yeah, we're gonna check out for a while. Right, so we are tucking into our food. As you can see, I've got some chapati with paneer and a couple of garlic fries inside. It is so good. So, so good. Mmm. Big portions as well. Massive. Oh, hello. so so good the portions are huge and we were just saying i think in the future we're just going to share one curry um get, like, maybe a double amount bits. double amount of side bits but just share a curry yeah one rice between us one, one rice. rice oh my goodness if you saw the rice we had earlier abby had a, a um, biryani and i had some plain rice with my curry it was like bigger than these full of rice yeah a bigger one of these tubs full of rice not tubs dishes full of rice so much food but it's so so good and so so cheap this has cost us eight pounds eight pounds um so two chapatis garlic fries two curries um and that's hotel price and that's hotel prices room service to our door um of course i gave the man a tip he was you know work an honest working man um which i definitely definitely respect so yeah, absolutely. And room, room service is 24-7? Room service is 24-7. It's very, very good. Very, very good. morning. It's day two. And we are in Mumbai. Um, we are hanging around the gate of India. Um, and we've got a few friends coming around to say hello. Um, we've got a couple of gentlemen just had a few photos with us. Um, saying, um, I'm a little bit nervous. How are you feeling? <laughs> it's okay. Um, anyway, here we are. There he is. Behind us here as well is the beautiful Taj Mahal Palace. That was... I think you can see it. There it 
this behind. Um, I need to do a bit of the uh, history research before I give you the lesson. Obviously, it was involved in a terrorist attack a few years ago. Well, I think it was actually 2008. No, thank you, sir. Um, no, thank you. Um, but uh, I'm going to do a bit of research on it and find out exactly what that's all about, and I'll let you guys know. But um, for now, we're just going to have a little walk around around the gateway of India um, and just see what we see. Here he is. I'm going to uh, leave it another 30 seconds, see if we get any anyone come over for a selfie. Tell you what, if you ever want to feel like a celebrity, come to the Gateway of India, because <laughs> you, you sort of live a life of a celebrity for about, well, however long you spend in um, But everyone's so pleasant, everyone's so nice. Um, they just say hello. It's when you first walk out of the hotel, people are sort of asking you for money, cash straight out your wallet. <laughs> and it's like, nope. Um, but uh, we always tip hard on its working people if they do something for us. Um, I think we've got a few people coming over for a photo now. Um, who knows? Okay, so we're in the back of a taxi. Um, we've got our first thumbs up. It's actually very nice. I actually think I prefer it to Pepsi. Taste test. What do you think? Good? Do you like thumbs up? Yeah. Thumbs up drink? Yeah. You like? He likes it. Who knows? Anyway, we're off to uh, a market um, to go and find some food. Ah, some man's having a, a shave over there. I'm not sure if you get to see that, but we'll definitely see some more of that. It's something I want to have, have a go at as well. figuring things out. We're still figuring it out. Um, everybody at the moment is being so friendly and so nice, which is, you know, which is very nice. Is there um, a lots of beep beep? Is that an ang angry or is it, no, is it normal? No? Normal. <laughs> normal. Okay. Okay. And they have one museum over there behind us. Museum? Museum. Yeah. What's in the museum? Fish aquarium and museum is, you know, the okay. oldest, all the statues over there. Is there an end of that? What is your favorite thing about Mumbai? Sorry? What's your favorite thing about Mumbai? Victoria? Yeah. yeah. I think that's down by the uh, docking yard. We're very close to this lorry. Shoe shining over there, which is pretty cool. You've got lots of different markets and shops. Peas. Okay, so we found a vegetarian restaurant, which actually isn't too far, isn't too hard to find around here. Um, we've just got ourselves a vegetable curry, um, a couple of rotis. It's been it's come with onion, chili, chili, um, chili lime, I think. And uh, normal limes. The man actually served it for us, bless him. And now we've got uh, some um, 
veg biryani on his way as well. As I said, we've uh, learned the lesson. We're going to share meals because there's always plenty enough for two. We don't like to waste. Um, but we're going to tuck in. This is exciting. This is very, very exciting. We're going to do a live taste test with you. The roti feels nice. As I said, the man puts on our plate. Mmm. Wow. Spicy. We asked, he asked if it was spicy or not. We said yes. Oh, that was the biryani. Oh, wow. Oh, so the biryani is going to be spicy. Mmm. That's fantastic. That's probably the best food we've had yet. I think. Personally. Taste wise, spice wise, it's beautiful. Wow, wow. Okay, so we've um, absolutely smashed down our food. Um, we've been given a couple of little bowls to wash our hands in, which is very nice. Um, plan of attack now is to go out, go and find some more water, um, and then um, everybody stare at me. I'm still trying to get used to this. Uh, Daniel, back. Thank you. One day, yeah? Um, just kidna. A uh, bill? Uh, the bill? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Many um, So we're going to get the bill and then, um, and then head off. We've actually been given some of these. Hold this for me. So we've, we've been looking and someone, everyone's been getting these. Are they mint? No. I don't know what that is. Um, Wanna try some? No. Oh, it's mint. Yeah, try some. No. Think like a refresher in your mouth. It's nice. Thank you. Six eighty-seven. So that's cost us about a fiver for all of that food. Not too bad. Right. Okay. So food is done. It's that was our first meal of the day when we were so, so hungry. It's just gone 25 past one. Um, it is extremely hot and like thick. How would you explain it? It's just like, I don't know, just like the most humid, humid. weather ever. Yeah, it's very, very humid. It's, uh, it's very, very warm. Hello. Um, people are, I think they're curious. I said, I'm, I'm getting a bit better with this camera in my hand. It's still a bit awkward. I'm still very new to this. I think we're gonna hook a left here. Or do we go straight down and left? Oh, there's a cow in the road. There are cows in the road. Let's go down here. I'm not sure if you guys can maybe see that. Hopefully you can. Um, there's some cows down here. That's the first cows I've seen. There's a lot of people staring at us, but uh, I think we're in quite a local's market. We're in, what are we, what, what is this market? We're in Calaba Market, if you've heard of it. Um, there's a couple of men playing a game down there which is pretty cool. I'm, I'm trying to be as respectful as I can, um, especially around the sort of Muslim community and their ladies, not showing you know, their faces and whatnot. I know they're trying to cover up as it is, so just trying to show, show that respect. Um, anyway, we're going down into this market. It looks, oh, there's a lot of flies on the floor there. I think we're gonna take a right down here, babe. Um, what am I doing? I think we're both still a little bit Hesitant, nervous. Should we see what's going on there? No. No? I think it's a the doctor or something. Watch out, babe. Um, oh, wow, there's massive geese in that cage. Oh, there's goats. There's a couple of goats. This is pretty cool. Um, we've got chickens. It's alright. Again, as a... As Abby's a, a vegan, this is uh, probably quite tough for her to view, but it's just culture. It's just culture. This is where we walked down earlier. We've actually already been here, so. Oh, at the end? Yeah, we walked past them chickens. Oh, they're different chickens. Oh, this is actually different. There's more chickens over there. So guys, we're showing you the raw, real, 
version of Mumbai. I want to turn the camera on, you don't want to just see our faces. And we'll just walk through the market and just show you what's about. Should we go this way? Mm -hmm. This is crazy. Very, very cool. Huh? I didn't see. Here we go, policeman on a bike. Well, that's the yeah, way we just were. That's just going to go up to where it was. We could have gone down there and didn't want to. So we'll head down this way. Hey, we're broadcasting to the world right now. This is our YouTube documentary of Mumbai. There's a shoe shop, it's pretty cool. I feel like we need to go and talk to some people, go and communicate, go and go and uh, have a chat with somebody on a stall maybe. Um, there's a bit of shouting going on down here. There are people. Oh, there's a bike behind me. Okay, who would have thought it? <laughs> All of a sudden, it's absolutely hammering it down. The gods have opened. Um, my God, we've just got a taxi back close enough to the hotel. The taxi driver wasn't sure where to drop us, so we've just been dropped up at the uh, Taj Mahal Palace, um, which we're running along the side of now. Uh, it is really pouring it down now. This is something else. We're going to get back, have a shower, get dry. Oh, it's heavy. Holy smoke. This is absolutely mental. I love it though. This is what it's all about. No, thank you. They're being up in camp left, right, and centre now. Wow, we. This is incredible. Oh, hello, mate. What I want to do. Oh, it's our guy. You don't want to say He doesn't want to go on camera. Huh? No, thank you, sir. We're going home. This man behind us is quite angry actually. We uh We've seen the city today, we've done lots. From where? Everywhere. Absolutely soaking wet. This guy is so angry. Because he asked about five times yesterday if we can go and his, go and do his tour with him. Um I think we've got no got another street down. Um but uh, we are absolutely soaked. All of a sudden it stopped raining. There's this guy behind us with the umbrella. As soon as I put the camera on, he, he hid himself. I think maybe he's a local scammer, who knows. But uh, he was trying to charge me outrageous prices for a, for a little tour um, yesterday. And what he does is he follows us back to our hotel, basically. No, I don't think he's following us now, but he knows, he knows where we are hotel wise and some some of them a couple of times have actually sat outside our hotel and waited for us um or it's just a coincidence that they're there when we come back out who knows um there's a shoe shining business just next door to our hotel which is pretty cool um but uh i can't really see much at my glasses that was a lot of fun i gotta be honest quite refreshing actually we've got some water abby any words not really, I'm soaking wet. <laughs> Just soaking wet. Yeah. Okay, so we have made it to Victoria Station in Mumbai city centre. Um, people are all rushing into their gates. We're gonna we're gonna wander in and see what it's all about. Um, yeah, we're gonna see what happens. It's, uh, there's a lot of people. There's a lot of people here, huh? It oh, it rained. Again. It rained very heavily, but thankfully we were in a taxi and then we took un cover underneath a tarpaulin in a phone shop, well, a phone case shop. Um, this man here is very perplexed by us. Watch your puddles. Lots of thick puddles everywhere. Oh, they're selling samosas and things in there in the station, which is quite cool. Now, this is, I presume, one of the biggest train stations in India, um, but I'm making that up. 
do your own research. I should have done some research before I got here, really. Uh, it's a missing people sign, yeah, that's sad. But a uh, police station here, you've got, and now it's in the hustle and bustle of, of Victoria Station. Um, wow, there's a lot going on. Again, it's a little bit awkward to have the camera out, but I'm doing it. I'm facing my fears. We're going to head down here, we're going to go through this column here. Wow. So let's see where you can actually go to. If there's any signs. Wow. So, as you can see, we're, we're wondering that you're with me. There's a lot of people staring at me now. Oh, someone just barged into me. Oh, oh, don't let go of me, I don't think. I think it's probably safe and we just stick together. I imagine it's probably quite easy to get lost in here. But, uh, yeah, we're in. We're in, we've made it. It's exciting. We're not actually getting on a train. We're, um, we've got a flight tomorrow to Goa, North Goa. <laughs> but uh, you can see as you walk around, you've got all sorts of different things. Again, try not to show these Muslim ladies. But it is, it is what it is, I guess. We're just out and about, having a bit of a film walking through the station, there's a booking office over there, people running, let's go and have a look at the trains. Now, for me, in London Waterloo, you've got all the gates and you have to scan your ticket. But here, it looks like you just walk straight on. There's no gate system, you can just walk straight on the train, that's going to Hanvel, wherever that is. Um, so, And here it is from the front. Victoria Station. How beautiful is that? Just stunning. The detail. Well, I won't bore you, but I don't know enough about it to bore you, to be honest. But uh, what I do know is that it's gorgeous. Um, oh, there's a man talking. I thought he was talking to me. Um, yeah, this is fantastic. What do you think? It is stunning, isn't it? It's very stunning. We're going to um, we're going to go and find somewhere for dinner soon. I think it's half four. I'm getting quite hungry. We've only had one meal today, so we're both feeling a little bit hungry. Um, wow. That is really breathtaking. <laughs> And you can just hear how loud it is here. It's just, you, you, the only way to do it is just to by immersing yourself straight into the city and the culture and their lifestyle. We just get, get mixed in with it. I, you know, I, I want to show you the front view rather than just showing you my face the whole way through. Um, it is starting to rain again and we're going to get a bit wet. There's a London bus there. How cool is that? a little bit different to that one. Wow. Um, that's where we came down. Over there. So I think we'll move on over this way. McDonald's. See where the life is. Oh, there's a McDonald's. I don't want a McDonald's. Oh, babe, turn around. Look at this. Oh, wee. That was stunning. Stunning, stunning place. This guy behind me is following me. This guy behind me is... He was looking at me a little bit funny. I think he was going to try and pickpocket us. Talking about our bear, he's, uh, he's doing this to our bags, I know. But uh, he was telling people we had bags. And he got very, very close to us. But uh, anyway, he's not following us. So happy days. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. So as we walk through into the valley. Oh. So there's a McDonald's over there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's just absolute chaos. 
That's the one word I think, if someone said to me, what's one word to describe Mumbai, I would say chaos. But actually it's controlled chaos, I think. I hear all these people in all these cars, but we've not seen one crash. I'm sure it happens a lot, but uh, yeah, we've naturally not seen one crash. Looks like there's a guy in the road in the camo organising the traffic. But uh, again, I could be wrong. Who knows? But this is Mumbai, guys. This is it. We're going to cross over the road. I should probably put the camera down so I can pay full attention so I don't get hit. What have you found? 7 Eleven. Go, up to you. Go, go, go. We're going in. We're in. What can you find? Some sweeties. Some protein bars. Protein bars might be a good idea. 45 rupees. We've got nuts in there. Yeah, they don't all. See, I'm heavily allergic to nuts. You're not heavily allergic to nuts at all. I'm not allergic, I just don't like them. Wow, it's like a... The ingredients are in uh, English. Oh, good. Makes it easy for you, doesn't it? Mm. <laughs> Your noodles, do you, you like? Oh, yeah. Get them at Tesco's at home. They do taste good, the noodles. Doritos? Mm -hmm. So many tackies. I really like the tackies. Huh? Fine for Okay, so we are undercover, we've found some cover. It is absolutely downpouring again. We've just been inside 7 Eleven and got ourselves a little Pepsi and a couple of other little bits. Got ourselves a protein shake we'll have later. Um, I think I'm struggling to get a lot of protein in while I'm here, to be honest. So if they're nice, maybe I'll make it a regular thing, who knows? Uh, the doggy just going past. Yeah, we asked the guy to get in his taxi and he said no. <laughs> oh well, we're, uh, we're just going to hang out undercover, we're in no rush, nowhere to be, so we're quite happy. This is the uh, situation of where we are. Okay, dinner has arrived, room service for one last time. Abby, what have we got? Oh, I think that's, yours. I think that's my Jal Frazee. Wow, that actually looks so it much better good. than I thought. Wow. How exciting. Oh, this is Ooh. your salad. No, that's the, that's the potato. Oh, is that the potato? Wow. Is that the aloo dum? Yeah. I think that's your salad. No, I think that's your because I've got chickpeas. Oh, okay. Fair that's enough. the potato. This must be. Wow. There you go. wow. Wow, very similar. Yeah. So they do look very we'll similar. Those. Yeah, we'll definitely share them both. My soup. Again, huge portions, hot and spicy soup. And. Yum. And just a couple of classic chapatis. Guys, we're going to absolutely tuck into this. How exciting. Yum. A couple of plates. We've got water. Is that water? That's water. Fresh. Yeah. Cool. Fresh. Amazing. Um, I wasn't sure if it was from last night's dinner, but no. that's okay. Awesome. It's uh yeah, let's let's absolutely tuck in. I'm I'm well excited. Right, take a bite from your salad. Live review. <laughs> it looks very oniony. It does look very oniony. But I like that. Oniony. Oniony, as you thought. And the potato? It's good. They have the same... Same taste? One of the potato, one of the chickpea. Oh, they're the same, but... They're pretty fair, literally. Maybe, maybe you ordered the wrong thing. No, I don't think so. Because the aloo dum is meant to be in a sauce. Oh, maybe they are. I think this potato was meant to be in like an orange sauce. Yeah, it's probably the wrong thing, but, but so it's good. I think it's the wrong thing, but it's okay. Does that taste good? It tastes good. Is that nice? My soup? Open the curry up one more time. We've got to get another one more look on that. Whoa. Can I try some of the sauce? That, absolutely. Try as much as you want. Share it. Mm. 
Oh, no, you'll she die. loves it. You'll die. That's unreal. She absolutely loves it. Wow. Try it now. Let me film you. All right, then. Oops. Mmm. <laughs> wow. That's spicy as well. Yeah, isn't it? Wow, that is just fantastic. Wow. Guys, we're gonna tuck in. We're gonna absolutely tuck in. Okay, guys, so we are calling it a night. This is the end of the video. Tomorrow we are traveling to... Duh, 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 duh. Goa. Goa. Um, we have a early morning flight tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. We are leaving here at about quarter past two, our taxi's booked for. So very early night. I doubt I actually sleep because I didn't actually sleep till about three o'clock in the morning last night. So we're excited to go to Goa. So we will be back with you traveling to Goa tomorrow morning. Cannot wait.